Hello guys, and welcome back to our new video. Amazon offers a huge opportunity for those who are interested in making money. There are numerous platforms on Amazon to make money online, and one of such is through Amazon Kindle Publishing. Amazon Kindle Publishing is one of the simplest and most effective techniques for making money online in 2022. You can also make money on Amazon by publishing your own books using Amazon Kindle Direct Publishing. If you have a passion for writing, you can earn money. And if you're not, you can hire the services of a ghostwriter. The book comes in digital format, and there is an option to print actual copies of your book too using Amazon's CreateSpace prints on demand. Many authors are earning it big on Amazon. The only important thing is that you must write something prolific and catching for you to make it on Amazon. Also, the more you write, the more money you make. Just to let you know, Amazon offers two types of publishing options. The steps discussed in this video are exclusively for Kindle Direct Publishing, and not Amazon Traditional Publishing. If you want to know how to make money with Kindle Publishing on Amazon in 2022, then come along. This guide will help you on how to start your Amazon Kindle Direct Publishing business, which covers how to create exceptional Amazon listing account, a solid marketing plan, and a book you will be happy belongs to you. How to publish a book on Amazon KDP Step 1. Open a Kindle Direct Publishing account on Amazon. Go to kdp.amazon.com and select Sign In or Sign Up. Use your Amazon account to log into the KDP system if you already have one. Otherwise, open a fresh KDP account. You must accept the terms of use because this is your first time signing in with KDP. When you do that, your Amazon Author dashboard will be displayed. Step 2. Add a new Kindle eBook. Because you are new to Amazon and this is your first book there, you won't have any titles displayed thus far. To add a new Kindle book, use the plus Kindle ebook checkbox. If the need arises that you have to halt inputting information, select save as draft at the bottom of the page. Step 3. Set your primary language. Set your primary language of your ebook by choosing your preferred language that you desire that that book should be written. Step 4. Input your book title and subtitle. This is very crucial. Know that the title of your book is critically vital, hence the need to pay attention to it. The success of your Amazon Kindle publishing business begins here. You need to have an appealing book title and cover if you want to experience higher sales of your books. Readers begin to judge your book immediately as soon as they see the cover, and they start reading your book from the title. It has to be compelling and captivating to make them stick with your book. So before choosing your book title, think deep and research magnetic titles. You can perform an Amazon search and select the appropriate keywords for which your product can be ranked. You can then select your title and base your book around this. Step 5. Enter the author name. In this stage, you are required to enter the author name. Input the name you want to publish under, the name that you want to appear on the book cover. The author name can either be your own name or a pen name. In the instance where you have more than one author, use the contributors box to enter the other names. Step 6. Enter your book description. You are permitted by Amazon to input up to 4,000 characters for your book description. The book description comprises of the write-up that is displayed on your book's detail page. Your book description can either make or break your success. It's simply the sales pitch that hooks or repels your readers. It's an important component of the marketing materials for your book. Give priority to it and let it be written carefully. Amazon makes it possible to join Author Central once your book is listed. This will help you have more control over the detail page of your book. Step 7. Verify your publishing rights. At this stage, you are expected to verify the right over your book. Select the radio button that says, I own the copyright and I hold the necessary publishing rights, in case you are the author of this book. Under US copyright law, you are the owner of the rights to your work immediately after you pen down anything in any form. Step 8. Choose your keywords. Consider these carefully. When these fields are filled, you're effectively saying, I want my book to appear when buyers input these keywords into an Amazon search selecting the appropriate keywords for which your product can be ranked. Step 9. Choose two categories for your book. 
Select two categories for your book using the Categories pop-up box. Delve deeper as far as you can with the plus options. This is yet another important marketing decision. It influences where people will find your book, what other books it will compete with, and even how difficult it will be to obtain a bestseller flag. Step 10. Choose the right age range if this applies. If your book is for teenagers or younger readers, use this box. If it's not for teens or younger readers, then leave it as is. If so, select each applicable minimum and maximum. Step 11. Choose your book release option. Before you are ready to publish, you will need a marketing strategy unless you currently have hundreds of individuals waiting in line to buy your book, especially for a book that is nonfiction. Media attention, book blurbs, early reviews, email lists, and other factors all influence book sales. It's far simpler to create that type of excitement for a new book, so it's crucial to publish it first and think about the marketing later. Before you choose a publication date, make a strategy for a comprehensive book launch. Regardless of the publishing date you decide on for the time being, you may continue entering the details for your book by selecting Save and Continue. Just keep in mind to revisit this and decide on a precise date before you release your book. Step 12. Choose your DRM rights. Ensure DRM is turned on. Digital rights management prohibits copies of your book from being copied and distributed for free. People may still use Kindle's lending feature to temporarily lend the book to friends even when DRM is enabled. Simply put, they cannot claim ownership of it. Step 13. Upload your book. Regardless of the options available, such as PDF or doc files, convert your ebook into a properly structured EPUB file before uploading it. Always utilize the most recent Kindle format to ensure that your book looks great on all e-readers. Although formatting a book is difficult, doing it well is essential if you want it to appear professional. And comparing to other ebook retailers, Amazon requires a slightly different format for ebooks. In a situation where your EPUB file is ready and you feel like viewing it to see how it will be displayed as an Amazon book, you can upload it here. Step 14. Upload your book cover. Books are often judged by their covers. Whether you like it or not, this is simply true, and a lot of marketing research supports it. The cover design of your book must be professionally done if you want it to sell. Avoid creating your own book covers. The cover of your book may look insignificant to you, but even as simple as it may be, a poor cover font can ruin your sales. That is why such priority must be given to the entire cover design. Step 15. Preview your book. After uploading your manuscript and cover, you can preview your book with the use of the Kindle Previewer. Avoid using the Launch Previewer button. Alternatively, you can click Preview on your computer and get the most recent Previewer app for Mac or Windows installed. Take your time with your preview, check and verify everything. Validate the cover photo, ensure to test each external link, and look at each and every page. It's not fun to read your own book again and again, but that's the cost of do-it-yourself publishing. Step 16. ISBN and Publisher For a Kindle ebook, there is no need for an ISBN or publisher. You can ignore these and leave them blank if you just want to publish on Amazon. If you wish to proceed, select Save and Continue from this point. Unless you click Publish your Kindle ebook at the bottom of the next page, Amazon won't publish your book. Step 17. Omit KDP Select for now. It can be added later. Your book could always be added to KDP Select after it has been launched. However, you must leave it in the program for at least three months once it has been added. The digital edition of your book must be unique to Amazon in order to qualify for KDP Select, which enlisted in Kindle Unlimited and offers you an additional marketing opportunity like Kindle Countdown discounts. Include this option in your overall strategy for book promotion. Step 18. Select your territories. Be sure to select all territories or worldwide rights unless you have a compelling reason not to. Selecting this feature brings your book for availability in all of Amazon's international markets anytime you are ready to publish it. Step 19. Select your royalty and pricing. Select your royalty rate within 35% and 70%. The 70% royalty will pay more for majority of the authors. 
This appears straightforward, but it introduces certain pricing constraints in addition to a slightly different royalty estimate. Set the list price after selecting Amazon.com as your primary marketplace. Other marketplaces prices will be determined by currency rates, although you may set each one individually if you choose. Step 20. Add the book to the matchbook and book lending services. These options are up to you to decide. However, if you want the 70% royalty, you must participate in book lending. Step 21. Save to draft until you're ready. Select Save as Draft once you're ready to set a publication date and publish your book. I cannot emphasize enough how crucial it is to plan out every part of your book's promotion before it is published. This extends beyond the cover, layout, pricing, and marketing strategy of your book. Your author branding is also included. When your book is published, you must create an Amazon author page with your author photo and bio. You should also include any blurbs on your book's detail page. Prepare those immediately. Finally, listen to your instincts. Regardless of how eager you are to see your book in the Kindle store, your inner self will notify you if something is not done. If you feel compelled to pause and correct anything, do so. Step 22. Self-publishing your print book. Create Space was formerly under the Amazon's print-on-demand publishing department, but now print books are handled by KDP. With the same KDP account, you can include the print version of your book, but that is a separate job. If you want to know more about how to be a successful publisher on Amazon Kindle publishing business and make money online, you can contact us for more information. I hope this video has helped you all. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, the official money pill, so you never miss any opportunity to make money online with easy and simple tricks that we bring up in our videos. Thank you and until next time.